वेलकम एवरी वन सो इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियोज़ ऑन एडॉल रिएक्शन आई हैव ऑलरेडी कवर्ड द बोरोन इनोलेट्स एंड द सिक्स मेम्बर ट्रांजिशन स्टेट दैट इज़ द जिमरमेन ट्रैक्सल ट्रांजिशन स्टेट वाई विच द एडॉल एडिशन टेक्स प्लेस सो दिस वॉज द लास्ट इन इट सीरीज विच इज मुकायामा एडॉल रिएक्शन सो हेयर वट वी यूज इज बेसिकली सेलाइलिनॉल ईथर एंड देन वी हैव अ कार्बोन सोर्स एंड दिस रिएक्शन बी रिएटेड बाई अ लुइस एसिड सो इट कैन बी टाइटेनियम क्लोराइड और एनी अदर लुइस एसिड सो इट विल गिव अ रिस्पेक्टिव एडॉल प्रोडक्ट ओके सो लेट्स लुक एट दी मुकयामा एडॉल रिएक्शन वॉट इज इट अबाउट सो एज आई सेट दैट इट इन्वॉल्व क्रॉस एडॉल रिएक्शन ऑफ अ सेलाइलिनॉल ईथर विद अ कार्बोन कंपाउंड इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ एंड Lewis acid. Now we know that whenever we are carrying out uh, adol condensation in presence of base, then generally the problem that we observe is self uh, polymerization, self condensation, you know, and number of other pro problems that take place whenever we are using uh, you know uh, uh, base strong basic conditions. So that is where these mukay mukayama adol condensation. they provide us with the lot of utility they are much more useful in handling because what we are doing we are converting one of the reacting substrates into its enol silylenol ether and then we are reacting it with the respective aldehyde theek okay? hai so this is how the reaction takes place now if we look at the second example which is very very important here we can control the reagio selectivity for example if i want to bring about a reaction on this carbon then what i need to do is to simply use a more hindered base so i know that the more hindered base is not going to abstract the proton from here it is definitely going to abstract from here so what i have used is this hindered base so this is also also this is nothing but an lda so it is going to give a kinetically controlled enolate which is uh, which is what we know that uh, always a least substituted uh, you know enolate is formed so it results in the formation of this silylenol ether which on reaction with the aldehyde and the titanium chloride condition give us this product cloud data suppose if we use triethylamine as a base then we know that thermodynamically controlled enolate is formed means when the enolate is treated with tritms chloride then we get the respective silylenol ether so by controlling the uh, base that we use we can also control the reagio selectivity and hence we can control the product that is formed so this is a very very good example and uh, you should be mount mindful of the fact that depending on the base the reagio selectivity varies okay now the most important thing about this particular reaction is its mechanism this is the reason why i decided to actually make this video now so far in all other cases i have discussed that whenever there is an adol reaction that takes place it proceeds via zimmermann trexler transition state or there are some other models that are there to define the occurrence of any diastereo selectivity that we observe in the product but here in the case of mukayama aldol the reaction takes place via open transition state this is more or less the generally accepted mechanism of this reaction so let us suppose uh, jo sabse important baat aapko yaad rakhni hai or the most important thing that you have to remember is that whether we start from z enolate means z silyl enol ether or e in silyl enol ether we always end up getting the synadol is the product that, that this is the product that we always end up getting we do not observe the formation of nt maybe nt product will form but that will be the minor product so syn product will always be the major product it doesn't matter whether you start from z uh, silylenol ether or e silylenol ether so we here uh, it is shown why so पहली चीज़ तो जैसे कि मैंने बोल दी है कि द रिएक्शन प्रोसीड्स वाया ओपन ट्रांजिशन स्टेट मॉडल तो अगर हम यहाँ देखें कि लेटर सी जेड लेटर सी जेड फॉर सफॉल ओके सो हेयर वी कैन सी इफ आई सी देन द एल डी हाइड इज इन ऑन द फ्रंट साइड एंड देन वी हैव दिस सिलाइल इन ऑल ईथर हेयर बोथ आर वन एंड दिस 
TMS OTMS group are on the same side that is why this is Z uh, Z Z enolate and let us suppose if I flip this then I also again I have these two group on the same side so this is also the Z product but in this case both these bulky group they are on the same side so this transition state or this conformer is not favorable okay so here the mx is nothing but they have <coughs> it shows the activation of uh, carbonyl carbon which felicitate uh, 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 which which increases the electrophilicity of this carbonyl carbon as a result of which uh, there is a new for formation of new bond takes place similarly in the case of e aldol when these two are here again we have this OTMS and R2 both these are opposite to each other but still if they are on the same size there is a lot of steric hindrance so that is why in this case also this particular conformer is preferred so as since we can see it doesn't matter whether you start from Z or E you always end up getting the sin product so this is something that you should be mindful of and you should remember whenever we talk, are talking about Mukiyama aldol reaction it always proceeds via open transition state so that is number one thing that you should remember second thing in material of Z silylenol ether or E silylenol ether or in other words in, in material of whether we start from Z enolate or E enolate we always end up getting the sin at all as the major product so these are the two things that are very important about this particular reaction or jo ki aapko yaad rakhni hai now let's look at a few example which are nothing but straightforward and the other is very very important so here if we see what they have done is just simply add tbf so i'm going to uh, we know that uh, this uh, tetrabutyl ammonium fluoride uh, are used to cleave this silylenol ether because the fluoride has a very good affinity for silicon so here you what you form is O negative so this O negative as soon as it forms it attacks the aldehyde to give the silylenol ether so this is also called the fluoride activated catalyzed at all condensation but here this is a very very important example i feel and it has a very good probability of being asked or a similar example to this question can be asked so what we have they have done they have taken this thia thioboronite so this is thioboronite and they have taken a ketene so ye cheez aapko yaad rakhni hai whenever this thioboronite is treated with ketene what we form is this boron enolate and once this boron enolate is formed it undergoes aldol condensation with the aldehyde to give the respective beta hydroxy thioester so this is a very very important example and i hope you can uh, understand what is happening in this particular example okay so just remember this particular thing okay chalo okay next one dekhte hain so mukaya mukai yama can this as i said that apart from you know uh, apart from titanium chloride we can also use other lewis acids so that is exactly what they have done they have used tin triflate and they have used this base so what you have formed is this uh, this enolate of, uh, of of tin and when you as soon as you add aldehyde what you get is the desired syn product again yahan par hum dekhne wali baat kya hai ki syn 2 nt is greater than 90 to 10 matlab jo aapka nto 10 bana hai jo humne abhi piche mechanism ke andar dekha what we saw in the mechanism that syn is always the major product and why is that because this addition between the uh, the 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 uh, the addition between the this tin compound this tin intermediate and aldehyde takes place via open chair transition state similarly on attack with the ketone we get the respective product now is ka ek enantio selective version agar hum dekhe to what they have done apart from using these two theek hai iski wajah se kya hoga yahan enolate banega they have used this chiral ligand so what this chiral ligand does this chiral ligand coordinates with the 
प्रोटीन एज अ रिजल्ट ऑफ विच वो क्या करता है इनकमिंग एल्डीहाइड को जो अप्रोच है वो एक तरफ से ही डायरेक्ट कर सकता है सो दिस इज द इनशियो सिलेक्टिव वेरियंट ऑफ मुकेमा एल्डोल रिएक्शन सो दिस इज समथिंग दैट आई थॉट आई शुड एड सो दैट यू शुड बी माइंडफुल ऑफ द फैक्ट दैट सच क्वेश्चन कैन ऑल्सो बी आज इन द एग्जाम ठीक है Now let's look at the last example uh, in which I have taken the enantio selective Mukayama aldol reaction. Here also what they have done they have taken this uh, aldehyde and then you have tintriflate other additive and you have this chiral ligand again look at the selectivity that we we have here it is 100 to 0 means you do not observe any anti product here so what you end up get is an exclusively syn product so this is something that you have to be mindful of and the the beta the beta zero chemistry at these two position is because is directed by this chiral ligand and this can be easily understood with the help of the the in transition state that is formed so what is happening basically ye jo chiral amine hai this is the chiral amine so what it is doing it is interacting with the tintriflate theek hai aur tintriflate ka kya hai double act do do role hai tin ek to coordinate kar raha hai aldehyde ke sath jiski wajah se electrophilic ban raha hai is carbon ko electrophilic carbon kar raha hai and one of the triplet groups of this uh, this tin triplet it is interacting with the other other you know other uh, tin additive that you have we have used and the acetate group of it it is you know then interacting with the tms triplet so what happened this is kind of a, what what you can say is a coordination sphere that is formed and uh, the approach of aldehyde on to this silylenol ether takes place preferentially from one side because of the presence of this chiral ligand that we have used that is why we exclusively form this syn product theek hai so this was about the mukayama aldol reaction so i hope you like the video i hope uh, it was uh, informative i hope you understood the reaction proceeds via mukayama aldol proceeds via open chain transition state and in material of e or z enolate we always end up getting the syn aldol as a major product theek hai chalo okay thanks a lot for watching the video and like share and subscribe thank you very much